A tip about Fusion Cubic Presets palette. On the left I have my regular Presets palette open, and on the right I have a Fusion Cubic Presets palette. If I close this, how can I reopen this? Press Ctrl F to open your Mesh Fusion Pi menu, then add Cubic Geometry, and then you have your Fusion Cubic Presets. In this preset palette, you have options for placement, scaling, and aligning. So, for instance, if I choose this bottle shape, set my placement to combined, scale to selected elements, and align to selected elements, now press this last icon, then you see that bottle shape gets added to the component selection that I have made, and the preset is also being scaled and aligned to those components. I'm going to press Ctrl Z to undo. Now, this video is about the fact that you can actually also use the regular preset browser to do this. So if I select a preset in my regular preset browser and now press this icon in the Fusion Cubic presets, then your regular presets are actually placed and scaled and aligned just like with Cubic presets. So using the Fusion Cubic Presets palette is not restricted to the cubics. You can actually also use them for your regular presets, which comes in very handy. And if you make some macros doing this, then of course you, even, you don't even have to open the Fusion Cubic Presets and you can simply use your macros for scaling and aligning. But it's not such, such a big deal to actually open your Fusion Cubic presets to do so. So comes in very handy if I make another selection. Now I have that result. Combine Z to undo if I want a single one for instance. So single align scale to elements. Click now. That is my result. So the Fusion Cubic Presets palette, very interesting for adding presets to your object. And as shown, you are not restricted to the cubics themselves. If you open the preset palette and select a preset, then you can use that also to add presets to your scene.